we take a look at the weather forecast, there is a little bit of a chance of rain, but that is typical for Florida at this time of the year. 86 degrees right now with some humidity in the area, and there is a good wind blowing right now to keep it a little bit cooled down. I'm John Roberts, alongside Kenny Wallace and Jeff Hammond. And Jeff, we're at the midpoint of this season, and unlike the Sprint Cup Series, where they reset with 10 races to go, the Nationwide Series does not reset, but right now we have a whale of a points race going we, on. We really do. The last two races, believe it or not, Regan Smith, who our point leader, had a 58-point lead, folks. The last two races, he's lost 50 points there. 30 points at the road course, and that's the most any series leader has ever done. And the thing is, it has brought everybody back together. I mean, it has really jammed everything up. And you take a quick look here, Kenny, at the way the points are structured right now. We basically got ourselves a horse race here, and we brought a lot of guys back into this race because of his mistakes. Jeff Hammond, I do believe this is the most competitive series I've seen in nationwide history. Here's why. Look at the top five. They're only 20 out. But listen to this stat. After this race, the top six, Kyle Larson's could leave tonight or tomorrow night with the points lead. So over the last couple of races, Regan Smith has lost 50 points, and that's the most in two races by the points leader.